Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see by the title down there, we are doing an Ulta haul. And I just wanted to show you guys the things that I bought um, this time around just because I did stock up in a few things. And I picked up a few things that I wanted to do some videos on. Before we get started, please don't forget to subscribe in the little button down there. It really helps me out. And if you want to know the things that I bought at Ulta, then just keep on watching. I was actually expecting them to send me like a little box, but they actually send it in this like bag. Okay, so I picked up, this is the Redken Wax Blast 10. This is a hairspray. And yeah, this is a hairspray. And it's a high impact finishing spray wax. And I picked this up because I think I saw somebody talk about it on TikTok. And I really like that it said wax. Um, I have, I used to have like curly hair, but whenever I style my hair curly, and I just miss like the volume and I actually tried it today and it gave me so much volume like my curls are actually like kind of like staying and it does give you like that hairspray texture that it feels a little bit hard um, but I feel like it still like manageable like it can still like move it around next I have the loving tan deluxe um, tanning lotion I picked this up back in July last year uh, because I was gonna go to a wedding and I needed to tan my legs and then I remember the other day I bought some like dresses on Old Navy because they were having a really good sale and I picked some up and I was like oh my god like I want to start wearing more shorts and like dresses because it's getting really really hot here in San Diego and I, I said I was like I need to pick some bronzer up so I just picked this up I used it before I looked for the little mint in the bathroom but I couldn't find it so I think I'm gonna have to pick it up but yeah I'm excited to use this again and be tan again because it gives you a really nice um like glow as well to your skin i just i really liked it the first time that i used it the next one this is the origins clay charcoal act active charcoal mask and i picked this up because i haven't seen a lot of videos on youtube and i wanted to do a first impression you guys know i love doing face masks like videos because i just i love wearing face masks and how amazing makes my like skin feel so i picked this up and I actually by the time you're watching this video the video that video is already up next i have the ordinary peeling solution this is a face mask as well but this is more to like use it like once a week like the origin says that you can use it like as often as you may need it during the week i've seen this around tiktok so much and i decided to pick it up it is very very affordable this little bottle cost around eight dollars and it has a lot of product so i just heard really good things about this mask and i really want to try it i have three lip liners here you guys know that i'm not that big of on like lip liners but i actually looked at these and i was like oh my god i was i don't know the packaging like got me to be honest it is such cute packaging and i was like oh my god i haven't tried anything from my crime like new from Lime Crime. So I wanted to try these are the um, Lime Crime Velveteens. And these are the lip pencils. And I do have a bunch of their um, liquid lipsticks that, oh, they're so, like, I got them a long time ago. And I actually really like their liquid lipsticks. And look at this packaging first. Let me just look at that packaging. Isn't that beautiful? So this is the shade, let me see. This is in the shade Angel, and I'm going to, like, swatch it for you. Actually, this is the one that I have on right now, and it is a beautiful nude shade. I really, really liked it. They were super smooth to apply. I had no trouble with it, like, blending it. I'm always really careful, and because I'm actually scared to, like, um, for the tip to, like, break. So I'm actually, like, really careful when I'm putting on lipstick or lip pencil. <laughs> The next one I have here, this is in the shade Cake. And this is more of a mauve uh, This is more of a mauve purplish um, shade. This is the shade Cake. And I don't know if you guys can see, but it's a little bit more on the purple side of the actual packaging. But once I swatched it, it's more pinky. And then the next one is the shade Platform. And this is more of a brownie, reddish, terracotta shade. And oh my god that is so pretty this one right here is the shade platform so those are the lip pencils that i picked up i'm like super excited like i said i already love the first one which was angel the one that i'm wearing today next i picked up this benefit 24 hour setter and this is a product that i've been wanting to try for a very long time and i uh, like you guys know i i'm into like soap brows and kind of like my brows to look like fluffy i love benefits like packaging i think it's like super cute 
So this is the, like I said, 24 hour brow setter. This is the little like actual packaging right here. And I've heard like it makes your eyebrows look super, super fluffy. Let me try it right now. I actually did not, I don't actually set my eyebrows, but let's see. I have like crazy hairs right at the beginning of my brow and that that's actually like set in place like wow okay I'm excited to keep trying that and then two products that I just needed to stack up because I was like running extremely low and this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Palmade in the shade soft brown and I am actually this is the second the third time actually that I bought this one just because it's obviously my favorite shade is a shade that kind of like goes with my hair color and everything and I've actually like finished two other of these so I actually really like this one I think I've mastered how to use a pomade um, you don't need a lot and just using the right brush which I totally recommend the Anastasia Beverly Hills 7B brush um, and it just makes your hair strokes look perfect and then I also picked up my favorite foundation they had a 2 for 20 um, kind of like promo going on and one is usually 15 so this is the L'Oreal 24 hour wear infallible foundation I actually did a review on this and it will be long linked down here on a card if you guys want to watch that video I picked up two like I said because they were having a promo and it is one of my favorite foundations and the last product I have here, this is the MAC Cosmetics Studio Fix uh, Powder Plus Foundation in the shade NC25. You guys know this is my holy grail. This is my everyday powder. And I just needed to pick up a new one because I completely hit pan. And I picked up a lighter shade, which is NC25. Um, just because I noticed that NC30 was a little bit, a, little, a tiny bit darker than I would like it to look and you could definitely see like the dif difference between my uh, face and my neck. That is it for today's Ulta haul. I'm excited to try some of these new to me products. If you guys enjoyed this please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the little button down there. It really really helps me out in this channel and if you would like me to try any other products leave them down in the comment section and I'll go ahead and pick those up and make a video for you guys. So yeah until then I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!